out in the wide open farmland just outside of Williamston. A haunting tale has gripped generations of Martin County residents. Wilford Griffin has lived along Yarrow Creek Road his entire life. There used to be a mill here and it was operated by a Mr. Yarrow and his wife. Got to the point that uh, uh, he decided that he would eliminate her and he tied a millstone around her neck and threw her in the <laughs> creek here. The story that uh, I have grown up with uh, says that at midnight you'll be able to hear Ms. Garrell screaming at this bridge. Yes, you could hear screams. Now, whether it might have been a screech owl at one time or it could have been the ghost of uh, uh, the late Mrs. Yarrell. The story behind how this so-called screaming bridge got its name varies a little depending on exactly who you talk to. But no matter what version of the story you believe, they all seem to circle back to the same haunting conclusion. Halloween night was always the best night. You were, your mind was ready for it. You could hear something whether it was there or not. We enjoyed being thrilled is what it was and the, uh, the mystery of it and the camaraderie, of course. Camaraderie that sometimes included a few pranks. One night we were cooking hot dogs and somebody had gotten there before us and gotten under the bridge <laughs> with a 12-gauge shotgun. <laughs> and ripped off three quick ones. And I'm gonna tell you what, that reverberation and that sound, that cleared us out really quick. A couple of pranksters uh, hid under the bridge and when she arrived, they uh, let out a blood curdling scream and that lady was convinced that the story of the screaming bridge existed. But Griffin isn't so sure of it all himself. I'm not sh sure that I believe the screaming part. I have never uh, heard the screaming and I really don't come down at midnight to check it out. And neither does anyone else these days. Don't think it is well known with the younger people who are growing up nowadays because the, uh, the story has been repeated as much. This was back during the 60s we're talking about. 40s, 50s, and 60s, uh, yes, it was very widely known. Take a midnight drive to the East's Screaming Bridge and listen if you dare. In Williamston, Martin County, Pierce Legion, not on your side.